Right, you alien scum. Everybody, get up against the wall. This is a raid. That's how we sit deep with smart mouth aliens. Now the rest of you, get up against the wall before I lose my temper again. What's this? Humans hiding out with aliens? They're Republic mutatives! Attack! <laughs> Ready? Nabodani <laughs> in here. You can't just come barging into someone's home. You're as bad as that pig Holden. I'll stay out of your way, but you're wasting your time. I don't have anything worth stealing. You again? Why do you keep bothering me? I can't help you there. Since this thing with Holden, I've been scared to leave my apartment. I don't know anything about what's going on in the outside world anymore. Just one of Darvik's men who can't keep his hands to himself. But all he got for his trouble was a nasty scar from my vibroblade. Too bad I'm the one still paying the price. I, I don't want to talk about it. I'm in enough trouble already. Besides, I don't know if I can trust you. Okay, I'll tell you. J just try and stay calm. The last thing I need is trouble with you and Holden. Holden's a spiteful little hut slug. He went and put out a bounty on my head for what I did. That's why I'm hiding out here. Wait! Think about what you're doing! If that pig had just kept his hands to himself, I wouldn't have had to give him that scar with my vibroblade. He gets drunk and tries to force himself on me, and I get a bounty put on my head for defending myself. Where's the justice in that? Holden's the one to blame, not me.
What's wrong with you? She doesn't deserve this. Then you're going to learn the same lesson I taught Holden. I'm not as helpless as I look. Tongue <laughs> Look, I know we're trying to keep a low profile, but this kind of attitude will draw attention we don't need. Kuyami jus chikata na patoga ya fulki kokogala jiji. Ga wana bot atagwa! Kegidora te kun watatimona ia bola. Runda di hotonga kun hanka bi. Wana kun bez ching palamule tonking ba nunotek. Tuk nincha tukune mulerabes. Chi gratu loda bograshi on neon comba chin tomo mochuba. Loda nita kun. Ita patisa batua kachatu tung. Bograsha kun tijaka um. Chubakaha chopa chawachuish yunku. Jodo jid bungarantang. Takum justak miki grabble mogo. Kachichu ita bodunga. Tolba bank, waleo ganda naru chuchut. Mogesha punka bola wana chikne. Pamule slimo pudadada nanga kumbist mule rabes. And I can tell you from experience that they aren't any good at all against a simple vibroblade. That's why the Republic has been training soldiers in hand to hand and melee combat. Tong hai tuam jiji jung lumpa ni ta poe tikitu dolpa da bongwaleo gandona chuchut kachi chu ita dundonga yuma lita kuto tun jila mulane ni dubobo wonga kumbis jang ba mulera ta kum justak miki grabble mogo kachi chu ita bodunga dolpa bank waleo gandana chuchut Mogesha punka bola wana chikne. A mule slimo podadara nanga kumbist mule rabes. Chi gratu loda pograshi on neon kumba chin tono mochuba. Loda nita kun. Ita patisa batua kachatu tong. Pograsha kun tijaka um. Chubakaha chopa chawachmish yunku. Jodo jit bungarantang. Tolpa da pongwale. Cabadum cu pilio botenia, bonanai cuchu, awaga bosca chocola, mucha jag panca. Runda di hotonga kun hanka bi, wana kun bez ching palamule, tonking ba nunotek, tuk nincha tu kune mule rabes, tong abog sha umnina. Wanga kumbist king balemuraya. Choni yon tun chichi idadwana. Kava volpa mulje gumana? Wi ita nan dayata. Wata yuma wama huhu nandetek. Ah, shatung ni patoga. Wano kuspe ching palamule tonke.
Tag, bis du bunko kuki bakpaka. Ching para chiska mule, tunarana nu prata, dunko sicha, duma wamama tus, keba toma. Nisha julorcha, kinkuno bule rajiko. Chan shak bulara, umrao chiska duchi, on chuban jiska yanki, titoke gratung. Kun chicha kun king kacha chono bro, bogra wala no tumba cha. Nechi chuna chuba ching lorda ita kun. We tam boragantong muli ra ashang turung ni na potata tuanga chun tize igrutu haga jijiwa wata chuma wana hu wama hulhu na tek. Si gratu loda bograsi onni un compa cin tondo mochuba loda nita kun ita patisa batua kacha tu tong bograsha kun ti jaka um chuba kaha chopa chawa chwish yunku jodo jid bungaran ta mucho shak pa khat ki no no da ma paole rachikun achuta Unga kun bis dulpi kiko yana, tong patugas magdilea. No problem. Got it. Pudu, Tony Rama na praka donko tsercha chupa panki. Well, watch, watch where you're walking. I just clean those floors. Oh, I get it. You figure that just because I'm a janitor, you don't have to show me any respect. I'm beneath you. Is that it? Yo, you'll change your tune the first time your plumbing breaks down and raw sewage floods your apartment. Then you'll be begging for Kadir to come help you out. There's no need to antagonize the man. Besides, do you want to live in filth? I sure don't. Well, we'll see who has the last laugh then. Now, if you ain't gonna be civil, then I got work to do. This place doesn't clean itself, you know. Hey there, wh well, watch, watch where you're walking. I just clean those floors. Hey! 
I do the best I can with the equipment I got. You're just like all the rest, complaining about me all the time. You, you'll change your tune the first time your plumbing breaks down and raw sewage floods your apartment. Then you'll be begging for Kadir to come help you out. There's no need to antagonize the man. Besides, do you want to live in filth? I sure don't. Well, we'll see who has the last laugh then. Now, if you ain't gonna be civil, then I got work to do. This place doesn't clean itself, you know. Hey there, watch, watch, watch where you're walking. I just clean those floors. Well, all right then, no hard feelings. Don't know how much I can tell you, but seeing as how you're new here, I guess I can try and help you out. Decent enough place to live, I guess, except for the lower levels. You also... I should get... Hey there, what? My name's Kadir. I'm the janitor for this building. You must be the new tenant here, right? Never thought they'd rent that abandoned apartment. Hmm. You look like an off-worlder. What happened, you get stuck here because of the quarantine? Can't see any other reason someone would want to rent that old apartment. Don't know how much I can tell you, but seeing as how you're new here, I guess I can try and help you out. Decent enough place to live, I guess, except for the lower levels. That's where the swoop gangs hang out. Just stay in Upper City and you'll be fine. You also might want to check out the cantina. I used to go there when I was younger. Good place to get a drink and find out what's going on in the upper city. Just keep following the apartment complex ring until you come to the elevator. It'll take you out to the upper street snare, then. And from there, just head south a ways. You can't miss it. I should get back to work anyway. I'll probably see you around. I'm here most of the time. The building doesn't clean itself, you know. Yes, what's in your mind? Me? Well, I've been a star pilot for the Republic for years. See, I'm not my sure of yours. I fought in the Mandalorian Wars before all this started. But with all that, I've never experienced anything like the slaughter of these Sith animals could unleash. Not even the Mandalorians were that senseless. My home world was one of the first planets to fall to Malak's fleet. The Sith bombed it into submission, and there wasn't a damn thing our Republic forces could do to stop her. It shouldn't be my fault. I did everything I could. I followed my orders and did my duty. That, that shouldn't mean I failed them. I, I didn't. I know that. I'm not angry at you. Don't think that. I, I must not be making much sense. You probably mean well with your questions. I'm just not accustomed to talking about my past very much. At all, actually. I'm more used to taking action. Keeping my mind focused on the business at hand. So let's just do that. If you have more questions, ask them later. Hello there. I haven't seen you in my shop before. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Kebla Yurt. Welcome to the Equipment Emporium. You looking to buy some supplies? My shop's the largest one in all of Upper Terrace. Best selection on the planet. Whatever you need, I've got. Well, mostly. Mostly? What do you mean by that? The Sith confiscated all my heavy weapons and they impounded all my ships and swoop bikes. But I've still got a real nice selection, if you're interested. 
Anything I can do to help a potential customer out. What do you want to know? I heard a couple of pods crash down in the Undercity. I bet the crash sites have already been stripped clean by the Sith, though. Unless the Swoop Gangs or Davix Men got there first. I don't have anything good to say about those swoop gangs. Zooming around on their swoop bikes, terrorizing the lower city like a bunch of animals. Things weren't so bad when the hidden Vex were running the show. But ever since the rise of the Black Volker gang, the lower city has been nothing short of a war zone. The Sith haven't even bothered trying to maintain order down there. And I heard a rumor that Davik's own people are having problems with the Black Volkers now. Oh, Davik's a legitimate businessman. If you get my drift, smuggling, slaving, extortion. Mm -hmm. They say he's a member of the Exchange, you know, the big intergalactic criminal organization. Mm, I've heard of the Exchange. Bad organization to cross. But if anyone has blockade-breaking ships, however, it's them. I have to pay them a protection fee every month, but it's reasonable. And I get most of my inventory through Davik and his suppliers. I'm just smart enough not to ask where it came from, you understand? Davik hates the Sith as much as anybody. The quarantine has put a real dent in his operations, too. But he's keeping a low profile as long as the occupation lasts. <laughs> Davik stays out of the way, and the Sith don't bother him. The swoop gangs could learn a thing or two from this tidy little arrangement, instead of always going after each other. Uh... It's not smart to say bad things about the people in power, if you get my meaning. I just wish the Sith would ease up on the quarantine, though. They're killing my business. I can't say I like having them here in Upper City, but it could be worse, and we're still a lot better off than the Lower City, what with those swoop gangs and all. Oh, you're one of those off-worlders, aren't you? Come to Terrace for a short business trip and end up stuck here because of the Sith quarantine, right? Oh, you can't be too happy. Trapped on an unfamiliar world and all. But Terrace isn't so bad, as long as you stay in the upper city. Just try to avoid the Sith. And stay out of the lower city. The swoop gangs are totally out of control. Even Davik's men are having trouble down there. Good day to you, then. Uh, remember to come back to my shop if you ever need any supplies. Welcome to the Equipment Emporium. Finest selection of supplies in all of Terrace. You interested in seeing what I have in stock? Uh, just so you know, the prices on the items are our final. No bargaining here. This isn't a swap meet, okay? I only deal in top-notch stuff. I'm here on official Sith business. 